Has your Maltese been keeping an eye on you? If you're wondering why does my Maltese stare at me, you're not alone. Dogs stare at us quite a lot, prompting many owners to try and decipher what the mysterious gaze could be about. While we might not be able to know what exactly is going through a dog's mind, that's why today's episode, we will share 10 reasons why does your Maltese stare at you. Number one, your Maltese is communicating love. The first big reason your Maltese is staring at you can simply be explained that he loves you. When a new mother holds her new baby and they look into each other's eyes, it has an amazing effect of releasing a powerful hormone called oxytocin. This hormone is often called the love hormone as it helps us connect and bond with one another. If you let your Maltese sleep with you, you may be getting more benefits from oxytocin. Eye contact is a big thing to us humans, and dogs may be the only species that really understands that. A study shows that dogs and their owners alike both experience an increased release of oxytocin when we stare amorously into one another's eyes. Dogs are the first and possibly only species besides humans that have been observed doing this. Number two, your Maltese wants something. Your Maltese stares might not always have loving intentions. If your Maltese is staring at you with an accompanying whimper or whining, he's most likely trying to communicate that he wants something from you. Learning how to read your dog's body language can go a long way in helping you bond with your dog as well as helping them to be better behaved. Your Maltese may be asking for you to let them outside to use the restroom, he may want you to play with him, or maybe he is dying for you to share some of your delicious chicken sandwich you are eating. When a Maltese stares at you while she is eating it's because of the ancient natural instinct for dogs to look at the pack leader during meal times as a sign of submission and asking for any scraps that they are willing to share. Number three, your Maltese is trying to read your cues. One of the biggest reasons your Maltese will stare at you is to gather information about the cues you are sending him. Maltese make the best companion dogs and want to please you at every turn. They thrive on being close to you and understanding your every move. They will follow you endlessly and are often nicknamed the Velcro breed just for that reason. Since Maltese are very loyal and very intelligent they can and will learn quickly. Working to establish yourself as a strong and confident leader in their presence is the key to teaching them as well as gaining their understanding and trust. Then they stare intently at you. They are looking to you for that confidence and guidance as the alpha member of their pack. Number four, your Maltese is trained to look at you. When you bring home a new puppy and first start teaching and training it, one of the most important things to teach them first is to look at you. Teaching them how to sit, stay, heal, settle, and all the other important commands is so much easier when your dog first knows to look at you. Dogs often recognize visual cues much easier and sooner than they can figure out what you want them to do purely by speaking the command. When your Maltese is trained to look at you are able to see your movements and interpret whether you want them to sit, stay, come, or something else. So for training purposes, if your dog looks at you a lot that will make your job a lot easier, take advantage of all that attention and see what fun tricks you can train them to do. Number five, your Maltese is confused. If your Maltese is looking at you and you are confused as to why, that may just be your answer as well. Sometimes we humans do funny and unpredictable things. If your Maltese is looking at you with his head tilted to one side and his ears perked at the attention, he's probably confused and wondering what you are doing or trying to communicate to him. Another sign of confusion in your Maltese may be licking of the lips or a quick shake of his body. This could show that the confusion is causing a bit of stress in your dog. Your Maltese may be asking for more clear directions and understanding of the behavior you're looking for from him. Unfortunately, as your Maltese ages and becomes a senior, his confused stares could indicate something more serious, such as cognitive dysfunction. Number six, they're showing aggressiveness. 
It's important to remember that puppy eyes are not the only glance in the canine vocabulary. If the dog is very stiff and still, it's best to avoid maintaining eye contact with them and to give them space to settle down. Aggressive stares will usually come up in interactions with unfamiliar dogs, not with owners. But it's always best to keep an eye out on body language and make sure to keep away if the signs point to a fearful or worried dog. Number seven, your Maltese is confrontational. Maltese can sometimes have what I like to call little dog syndrome. They try to make up for their small size by acting more authoritative or bigger than they really are. Maltese are not inherently aggressive, but it's still very important to socialize your dog well when they are young. If your Maltese is not well socialized as a puppy, his stare could be confrontational and a warning that something bad is going to happen. If your Maltese has an icy hard stare, accompanied by a low growl or baring of teeth, proceed with caution. Maltese are unlikely to show this behavior to their owners, but may do this when feeling threatened. Number 8. They're experiencing cognitive dysfunction. If your older dog is staring constantly at you with no apparent reason, this behavior could be a sign of an illness known as the cognitive dysfunction syndrome in dogs. Wandering around aimlessly, forgetting basic commands and looking disoriented in familiar settings are other signs that your dog might be suffering from cognitive decline. Make sure you check with your vet if you notice any unusual signs accompanying your dog's habit of staring at you. Number 9. They're begging for food. Dogs will often want to share food with their owners. Whether you're sitting at the table having dinner or snacking in front of the TV, if you feel your canine companion staring you down, it's probably because they want a bite of what you're having. Be careful in giving up and feeding your dog in those moments as it may turn into a habit that's difficult to break. Number 10. They want your protection when pooing. If your dog stares at you while they're going to the toilet, it could be because they feel vulnerable and are looking to you for reassurance and protection. While they are pooing, dogs are relatively defenseless and not in a position to fight or run away from any threats. If your dog stares at you while they poo, take it as a compliment that they are looking to you as their trusted protector to keep an eye out for danger. Hopefully by now, you've got the answer to the question, why does your Maltese stare at you?